from VOA Learning English, this is the Technology Report. The American company IBM says it has developed a microprocessor or computer chip that works much like the human brain. IBM calls the chip True North. It is the size of a postage stamp, but it has 5.4 billion parts that work like the brain's neurons and synapses. Neurons and synapses are the cells and electric connections that carry messages to and from the brain. True North has electronics that act like 1 million neurons and 256 million synapses. The human brain has many billions more of each. But IBM says it can set up the microprocessor to understand and solve complex problems like humans would. The company says True North could be used in many ways like assisting in search and rescue operations. The device is still being tested, but IBM says it could be available for public use within three years. True North is just one example of machines becoming more like human beings. Such technology is called artificial intelligence. Some people believe computers will someday become more intelligent than humans. Jonathan Mugen wrote The Curiosity Cycle, a book about the relationship between humans and computers. He tells VOA that it is time to prepare for a future in which computers have more control over life. He says technology expands as human knowledge expands. He says human intelligence develops through the slower process of evolution. Mr. Mugen believes that smarter computers are good for people. He says intelligent machines can help individuals solve many difficult problems. But he also says it is hard to predict what will happen when computers become smarter than humans. For VOA Learning English, I'm Alex Villarreal.